this is Stampy, and welcome to a new Let's Play on Skylanders Trap Team. This is my first ever time playing a Skylanders game, but lots of you suggested to me that I should check out Skylanders, and you know what? Sometimes when you talk to me, I listen, and so I've decided uh, to get the newest game in the series, uh, which is Trap Team. And as I said, I have no idea what I'm going into here, uh, but I have lots of toys that I got with the game. Well, I have two toys. And uh, these are basically going to be the characters uh, that I'm going to be able to play with in the game. And I'm going to go straight into playing a brand new story. Greetings, Portal Master. I am Eon, and I have come to guide you on a great journey. Welcome to Skylands, a magical world of wonder and adventure, protected by the greatest heroes ever known, the Skylanders. <laughs> But Skylands wasn't always so peaceful. Once it was held in the vicious grip of the most notorious evildoers Skylands has ever known. The Doom Raiders. <laughs> Striking from their hideout, deep in the savage badlands, the Doom Raiders plundered without mercy until no place was safe. <laughs> Fortunately, an elite team of Skylanders, wielding legendary weapons, was called upon to track down these villains and bring them to justice. They were... the Trap Team. Here we go. These are the good guys, the Trap Team. And so I got two characters of the game. One is called Food Fight, and one is called Snapshot. And I think that's Snapshot there. Yeah, see that guy there? The guy shooting the arrow? That's me. That's one of the characters I have. I seem pretty good. I seem to take out that chef with the whisk pretty well there. <laughs> oh, we want to watch out though. Here comes a big guy. And he looks hungry. <laughs> Once captured. The Doom Raiders were taken to the most impenetrable fortress ever constructed, Cloudcracker Prison. Locked away behind walls of pure Traptanium, the Doom Raiders would never again threaten Skylands. <laughs> or so it seemed for many years, until a familiar evil returned. <laughs> the Trap Team was hurled far away from Skylands, and as they were drawn away from its magic, they began to shrink. Meanwhile, the shattered fragments of Cloudcracker Prison were transformed into powerful traps, but now you have found them. And just in time, Skylands' most infamous evildoers are on the loose again. It is up to you and your Skylanders to track them down before it is too late. A great adventure awaits you, Portal Master. Behold. Woo! Let's do it! As head of security and secret ninja commando operations, <laughs> let me welcome you to the grand opening of Skylander Academy. Oh boy, this is great, Callie. I mean, a new Skylander headquarters? There hasn't been one in ages. I know, Hugo. And Buzz is the most legendary Skylander trainer ever. But there's something familiar about him. Yeah, I know what you mean. I've seen his kind before. Big show off. Jeez, is he still talking? With the opening of the new Skylander Academy, may it usher in a new age of safety, security, and... Explosions. Soldiers! Holy guacamole! That thing landed smack dab in the middle of our annual soda festival. Rip, rip, stay put, folks, while the Skylanders and I check it out. Oh no, they're ruining the soda festival. <laughs> Here we go, chapter one, Soda Springs. Uh-oh, this doesn't look good. Oh no, it's the big guy. Of course, it's the big guy. And he's drinking all of our soda by the looks of things. Oh, poor little people. I guess we're going to need to go and save them before he drinks all of the soda.
And there's Buzz. Wonder where my Skylander operative is. Okay, let's do it. So what does it say? Player one, place a Skylander on the Traptanium portal. Okay, so I have my little figurines. I'm going to place down Food Fight, and hopefully he should appear in the game. There we go. Just like magic, there's Food Fight with his tomato launcher. <laughs> the most dangerous weapon. Everybody fears my rotten tomatoes. <laughs> right, so what can I do? So I can shoot them. I can... Oh, what's that? Oh, I can put down like a little landminer. That's pretty cool. And uh, can I do anything else? Uh, that seems to be all I can do for now. Are those, are those balloons flowing above me? I can see their shadows. That's a Skylander, all right. My name's Buzz, head of security and secret ninja commando operations around here. <clears throat> now, how's about we go investigate all this ruckus? I think I know what's going on. Use your attacks to clear out all this stuff. There's a big blue slug jumped in and is drinking all of our soda. And so I am going to have to go and try and sort it out. So let's go try and take out all of these things. Go and take out the uh, the barrels as well. And make my way I'll uh, make my way through here. And oh, that was a bit dangerous. All the rocks falling all over the place. Hello. <laughs> I'll save you. I love the uh, the puddles of soda uh, that are lying around on the uh, the floor as well. And I love the fact that there's just little puddles of soda all over the place. And uh, what's this? Uh, press R2 to fire the cannon. I think, I think it's a, um, I think it's a barrel of soda with a cork that's gonna fire out. And there we go! <laughs> I managed to, uh, I managed to uh, destroy the door. And uh, now let's go carrying on going through, and let's make our way to the big guy. And what's, what's going on here? There seems to be a, there seems to be a pile of turtles. Okay, so I can push the turtles, and then I can go and get through. I guess I need to, to push these as well. And oh look, I think there's a radio over here. Yeah! I think I can, I can switch the, uh, the radio station I listen to. <laughs> Broadcasting out of somewhere. <laughs> oh, he gave me money. Yay! Money, 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 money. All right, let's go and uh, shoot all of these things and uh, try and collect everything up. And I will be honest, by the way, I did have uh, one attempt uh, of uh, doing this video before, uh, but then the uh, the video file went corrupt, uh, so I am doing it again. So I have seen this uh, very beginning bit before, uh, but after here, uh, I have no idea what's going to happen. This may look like an ordinary harmless little sheep, but I can personally assure you that sheep creep here is bad news. In fact, he's supposed to be in Cloudcracker Prison for leading an ill-fated sheep rebellion. But hey, this gives us a perfect opportunity to practice our trapping skills. Really? Go ahead and take him down for me, will ya? Doesn't look very evil. It's just a, it's just a little sheep. I kind of don't want to trap it. Oh wait, no, it's a sheep with bazookas. <laughs> okay, maybe we should go after it then. Sheep creep. Okay, so what you can do in this game is you basically trap the creeps or the uh, the villains in uh, little crystals, little traptanium traps. And uh, so what I'm going to try and do is I uh, try and take out the sheep and try and trap him. He seems pretty deadly, to be honest. He's firing corks at me, and I'm firing tomatoes back at him. Let's try and let's try and throw down a, a few landmines then, shall we? See if we can get him with one of them. Is that gonna hurt him? Fire a few more tomatoes. He's running away, and there we go. I took out the sheep creep. Sheep creep defeated. Whoop whoop. Okay, so now if I put the uh, the little life trap, life trap into in the the, uh, the traptanium trap. portal, I should hopefully trap the sheep. <laughs> I did it. I got my very own sheep creep. <laughs> and all of the uh, the sheep noises that you hear, they're sheep actually creep, coming out trapped. of the actual portal. That's not coming out of my uh, television. Uh, that's coming out of the actual portal. It's got a little speaker on the front. And so, yeah, we're going to hear some barring in the background as I <laughs> as I go around as the sheep. <laughs> oh, that's so ridiculous. Yay, and now I'm a sheep. Boing, boing, boing. <laughs> I love the little legs. To play as your captured enemy. Then press the tag button again to return to playing as your Skyland. And so now, because I have the uh, the sheep captured, I can switch between playing as the sheep uh, or uh, whichever Skylander I want as well. I just love the little legs. Look at the way it hops around. Look at the little legs. And then I jump and go, doing, doing. So what can the sheep do then? I can I can fire my corks all over the place. And uh, what else can I do? And oh, and I can turn into a big ball. Is that really an attack? Does that do much? Do these little balls of wool do anything? 
<laughs> I love the way, look, you can see my little head upside down. Now watch this. If I do this, you see my little upside down head there? <laughs> this is a, a weird collection of sheep. I think you can see in the, uh, the bottom left hand corner of the screen. I think that's for, for how long uh, I can play as the, this sheep uh, until I need to, to go and switch back to my, my Skylander. So let's uh, switch back for now and uh, then I can go and let the, uh, the sheep charge up. And I guess these Don't little jump pads allow me to out. to and jump up here, and uh, then I can get across here. Oh, I think I need to I think I need to push the the turtle across first. So let's go and uh, press the press the turtle over here, and then I should uh, be able to to go and yeah. jump across to the the other side. Actually, wait, is there is there something down here? Ah, is this a secret bit? There is. I have found a secret cave. I have found the hidden flavor grotto. What's this going to allow me to do? I managed to get the winged sapphire. It's like a like a little bat butterfly with a little sapphire in the middle. How pretty! <laughs> and uh, now I can collect up all of this. Is this like chocolate? Oh, it's money! I thought there was all chocolate there. It was all uh, money, all stacked up high. So I was able to to collect a bit of money. I do actually have more money than I should have uh, because, as I told you, I tried to do this video before, but the uh, the video failed. Uh, so I think I do have a, a little bit of uh, extra money. Uh, so I do have a, a bit of a head start. I've also got a um. Uh, a few upgrades uh, for my for my other character, Snapshot, uh, who I'm going to show you in a little bit. Uh, basically, you use money to, to buy upgrades, and I'm pretty sure that they're assigned to the character and not the game, which means that, say if I took this character to someone else's house and uh, played on their game, uh, I should have all of the, uh, the same upgrades uh, as I did before. So that's going to be rather handy. For a minute, that looks like Traptidium! I haven't seen that magical stuff in a long time. Not sure what Traptanium would be doing here, but I know that only the righteously awesome power of a Trap Master's crystal weapon can break it open. Okay, so I'm gonna have to switch over now uh, to Snapshot uh, because he has the uh, the special weapons uh, that should uh, be able to break up the uh, the Traptanium. Trap Master Skylander. And uh, because I've never played any of these uh, these games before, I'm going to have to leave it to, to all of you. <laughs> Did you hear that sheep in the background going crazy? Yeah, I'm going to have to leave it to, to all of you uh, to recommend which characters I should get, because I have no idea which ones are the best ones. I think I'm going to go for the ones that are funny or just look cool, rather than the ones which are the strongest. <laughs> which is why I'm uh, preferring to play as... um as a food fight uh, rather than uh, this guy because even though food fight probably isn't as powerful he just looks funny and he fires tomatoes and that makes me laugh anyway it looks like there's a, a chest here that we can uh, go and break open so let's go and mash 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 potato <laughs> and uh, let's go and get a whole lot of money and rings and a teapot as well flew out there I can go and take the the teapot I don't know how it didn't smash and you can just hear the sheep in the background you can actually turn the the volume up and down uh, of the uh, the trapped villains and uh, I don't know what do you reckon should I leave it as it is I could even turn it louder or turn it down I don't know if it would be annoying just hearing the little sounds in the background I kind of like it but if you think it might annoy you uh, then I can turn the sound down or off if you'd rather I like that but if you really want to stay ahead of the game you'll need to check out these elemental gates it can only be opened by a trap master of that same element and when they are Boomsticks! You now have access to a brand new area which contains a magical hat. Why do you want a magical hat? <laughs> because they're awesome! And they make you stronger. That's the magical part. I want a magical hat. I want a magical hat. I want a magical hat. Let me in. Let me in. Let me in. Let me in. <laughs> I'm actually going to switch over to uh, Food Fight again once I go through. Uh, let me see if it lets me actually. Yeah, I'm going to switch over to, to Food Fight. And uh, see if it lets me get a magical hat for food fight because uh, last time I got one for um, uh, for snapshot. I'm gonna see if it's gonna let me get one for for food fight now. So let me go and uh, break away all of these things. And uh, I think uh, what happens if I bounce up here? Oh, here we go. It's just uh, a load more money. And uh, what I need to do here is go and try and push the turtles into the the clouds of smoke, and then I ride them. Honestly, that's honestly what I need to do. I need to ride on the flying turtles. Oh, he dropped down. Oh, there we go. 
<laughs> he came back up then. I panicked then. I panicked that I just killed the turtle by pushing him off. I like the way they retract back into their shell and look all scared as they're, <laughs> as they're floating around. I don't blame them. I'd be kind of scared if I was floating around like that too. And look how angry my guy looks. Look at the, the face he's pulling. Right, I need to go and try and make a big jump. And here we go. I got the present. So let me go and mash open the present. <laughs> Why don't I just open the uh, the ribbon elegantly? And yeah, here we go. So I look it looks like I got a uh, another hat. I got the uh, the turtle hat, which gives me plus 7 armor. And so let's put the the hat on. Is it going to really fit? Nope. Nope, there's the answer. Nope, it does not fit. <laughs> My hair is um yeah, my hair doesn't seem to be the uh, the right kind of shape to, to put a hat on. I hope I don't end up getting hat hair. <laughs> uh, but no worries. Uh, I got myself a, a shell hat, uh, which is going to give me plus seven armor, which is going to be very useful. And uh, let's go carry on. And let's go and try and find uh, that big blue guy and see if we can take him out. From earlier. Well, this here's a super bounce pad. <laughs> take it and find out why. <laughs> I have a guess. Right, ready? Three, two, one, and... Woo! <laughs> that was one super bounce pad. And look at the, the little streams of soda all over the place. <laughs> I love the way I'm just causing more destruction. Like, I'm supposed to be saving the day here, but I'm just causing, like, way more destruction than if I wasn't here. And oh, is this a... Is this a secret area down here? There seems to be a, another door. Oh, it's got a big... It's got a big question mark on it. Can this I... Can I get through here? This mystery gate, Portal Master, requiring an unknown element. Ooh, an unknown element. Does that mean there's an element called unknown? Or do we just not know which element I need? I'm not sure yet. And I found a story scroll. I believe I, I'd found this one before. I think it basically literally tells you stories. Uh, you found a story scroll. Meditations on Boom, Chapter 1. Would you like to read the scroll? <gasps> no, I don't fancy reading the scroll. I don't know about you. I, I don't fancy reading a scroll right now. I want to play. I want to shoot things and fight things. I want to fire tomatoes at things. And what's this? I found a soul gem for blades, uh, a new power unlocked, instant swirl shards. That would be much more useful if I did have blades, I will be honest, but uh, I guess if I if I do get blades, uh, then I'm going to have this uh, special ability. And blades does look pretty cool, it's like a tiny dragon. Uh, there's lots of dragons in this game actually. Uh, the very first Skylanders uh, was a uh, Spyro game, and a Spyro is a dragon, and so there are all, awful lots of dragons in that. <laughs> that sheep making weird noises every now and again uh, makes me laugh. I don't think, even though I am the uh, the right element, I don't think I can go through uh, because I'm not a trap master. Uh, so Snapshot uh, is a trap master, but Food Fight, uh, which is this character, is just a just an average standard Skylander. So I don't think I can actually make my way through here. Uh, but no worries, uh, it doesn't matter. I will probably uh, be getting a, a few more trap masters in the future. But first, it looks like I am taking out a whole load of googlies. Let's just try and shoot all of my tomatoes at them. It's really here to uh, really hard to hit them uh, as they're coming up the uh, the ramp. Uh, because my tomatoes fire quite high, so I wasn't able to hit any of them. Let's go and try and do another mine. Can I get him? Will it get him? Yeah, there we go. <laughs> he is pretty good. Food fight is pretty handy. And look at this. Look at this massive stream of soda. Okay, so I need the uh, the tech element uh, in order to, to make my way through that gateway. So I guess once I have the uh, the tech element, uh, then I can come back here. And is there anywhere I can go up here? I know that there is... um. There's lots of secrets in the game. They like to have lots of secret areas. And I know I've found one, but only one so far. So uh, I want to try and keep my eyes peeled uh, to see if I can find any of the others. And oh, here we go. Looks like we found the big slug guy. His name's the Gulper. And strange thing is, he's supposed to be locked up in Cloud Cracker Prison too. Something very peculiar going on here. And I suggest we get to the bottom of it. Pronto. All right. Looks like we need to try and take out Gulper before he drinks all of our soda. soda. I must have soda. <laughs> I guess he's rather thirsty. And I th looks like he's in the right place at the soda festival. Oh, that's our soda. Oh. Ah, so as he drinks soda, he gets bigger. The gulper. Oh, we could trap him. We could put him into one of our one of our water traps, I think. <laughs> right. So I guess the uh, the aim of the game 
is uh, going to be to try and stop him uh, from getting too much soda before he gets too big. And oh look, oh look, there's some some Traptanium here. All right, let's switch back over uh, to Snapshot then, shall we? And uh, let's break our way through. There might be a, a secret area uh, or something behind uh, some of this Traptanium. You see, he's got these special weapons. Uh, that is what uh, allows him to break through. Let me go and try and smash my way through if I can. Shoot it with my arrows for a bit and keep whacking it. I don't know. Watch out there, panda. <laughs> I am uh, firing things all over the place. And here we go. Here's a chest for us to open. Mash, 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 potato. Yay. Money's, 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 money's. So I can use this to buy some some more upgrades. That sheet makes me laugh so much. Just every now in the background, I hear a little as I'm playing. I like it. I like it. Ah, dear. Anyway, we have sadly just about run out of time in this episode here. But don't worry. I will be playing through the entire Skylanders Trap Team story mode. And so there'll be a link to the next episode up very soon. You can see that in the description. But for now, I want to thank you all very much for watching. And I will see you all later. 